Hey, it's Jackie as Peasant Belle today, and I'm so excited to show you guys these three inspired hairstyles from the new live action remake of Beauty and the Beast. I am so excited to see this movie. I haven't even seen it yet. I've only seen the behind the scenes, and I came across these hairstyles that I'm recreating today, and what's super cool about them is they're really easy to do, but also you can like build them up on top of each other, so you can wear like all three hairstyles in one day if you really want to. Let me know what you think in the comments, and make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you love movie recreations, and also please let me know if you'd like to see like the full bell look because I think that would be really fun as well. And anyways, let's get started with the hairstyles. Alright, so you can see my seriously makeshift peasant bell outfit. And with my natural hair, I'm starting by parting just about two inches backwards off center. And then brush out your hair and you can do this style with medium length hair. You don't need tons of length. And now just section off the two sides we just created from the part and comb back the rest of your hair. I'm adding Living Proof Dry Volume Blast to the roots. This adds a bit of texture and volume without teasing and keeps my hair in place a little better. With a tiny elastic, group off this hair to make sure it stays neatly back. With those side pieces, we're going to create the twists that go backwards. So again, taking my dry volume blast, I'm applying this to the roots for some texture. Now just curl your hair going backwards. I'm using a big barrel and this will just help the hair flow. Brush out the curls, I like to tease a bit for a fluffy texture so my hair looks thicker into the twist. And take a front section, twist backwards gently, and add in hair into the twist in like big sections, you don't want to do this piece by piece, just kind of bring it all together along the hairline and then pin in place with a large clip so we can easily combine the other side with it. With a couple bobby pins, pin the twist upwards for a more standout look that you know will stay in place. Repeat on the other side, so just twist, add in hair and clip at the back, pin the twist upwards and then now that you have both sides, take out the clips and combine the two twists into a mini elastic. And flip the ponytail up and through, this is a butterfly twist and this will tighten the style and will give you a pretty twisted detail right where the elastic is. Add some texture to the rest of the hair with undone curls. This is the first twisted half updo inspired by Emma. I found this very textured blazer from Zara to complete the look. Time to add a simple step for this next iconic Village Belle look. Gather the remaining hair into a low ponytail. Spread the hair above the elastic so you have a hole and then pull the pony up and through to get a second twist. Fluff out the second twist and now we gotta add a bow. This bow is from Forever 21 so I'm just tying it around and making sure that it's tight and stays put. And I love this look, it is so princess like and soft and with a couple steps let's create a gorgeous effortless bun updo. <laughs> First for accessories, I'm wearing a jean headband. I found this at Hudson's Bay and you can easily make your own with a strip of fabric and wedge this into the style so that the twists cover the sides of the band. Take the pony elastic and pull it lower so the butterfly twist loosens up. Using a small bun maker, you can find this at H&M, Forever 21 or Claire's, pin to the back of your head. Now just bring the pony upwards and mold the loose twist around the bun shape and pin with some bobby pins. Add some more texture by moving around some pieces in the twist and pin tighter to the bun. And with the ends I'm just twisting and pinning again around the bun. Make
make sure you have some little flyaway pieces for a worn in look and there you have it. Let me know which Village Belle hairstyle is your favorite. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this series of Belle inspired hairstyles from the new remake and if you did make sure you hit that thumbs up button and subscribe so you don't miss out on any of my videos and sometimes I like to pick out a fragrance for like a character or just to finish off a look and I found a perfect one for Belle so this is the new line from the body shop this is the almond milk and honey for sensitive dry skin and this is the bath milk right here and maybe I just think it goes with the character because I look kind of like a milkmaid right now but definitely check this out it's one of my favorite lines they've come out with and smell it and let me know if you think of Belle too because it's just a really soft scent that's really nice. So this isn't sponsored, but I did go to their launch party and I've been loving this new product. And let me know in the comments which hairstyle was your favorite. And also, if you haven't followed me on Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook, Twitter, all of my links are down below and you'll stay updated with me and talk to me on live streams. And I'll see you in my next tutorial. Every morning's just the same Since the morning that we came To this poor provincial town Good morning, Belle. Good morning, Lucia. Where are you off to? The bookstore. I just finished the most amazing story about a beanstalk and an ogre and... Hurry! The baguettes! Hurry up!